PM. Sasawa. Our party leader, His Excellency Raila Molo Odinga, my fellow deputy, Hassan Joho, honorable delegates, ladies and gentlemen. Siku ya leo ni siku ya muhimu. And being the first time that we are meeting after elections, the 2022 elections, I want to thank all of you for the role that you played during the last elections that enabled us to get as many seats that we got as reported today in the Secretary General's report. Ladies and gentlemen, as you come here, you must know that ODM is a national party. It is not easy to put up a national party like we have ODM. And I want to thank my party leader for the sacrifices that he has made to make sure ODM stands the way it is for the last 19 years. There are other parties that were formed and the parties collapsed when the founders retired in active politics or when they passed on. There are also some parties which have survived for many years. A party like ANC in South Africa has survived for so many years and it has won the presidency since independence of that country. The party like CCM in our neighbor, neighbor country, Tanzania, has survived for so many years and it has also won the presidency since the independence of that country. That is where we want ODM to be, a party that will live beyond ourselves as we move on, as we retire, as we pass on, ODM remains as a major ca a party in this country. Some of us, you know very well where we come from, there are those regional parties, but we have not joined regional parties because we know those regional parties will go nowhere. What they can do is just support others and then a few of their party leaders get appointments here and there and that's all they can do. But we as a party ODM, this is the only party, because being a national party, that can form a government. And I'm happy that my colleague has said that we are going to form the, ne the next government 2027. The loss of, two, of 2022 was very painful to some of us, and I, I know even to many of you, it was very painful when our election was stolen. But let me say this, when this issue of our party leader going to AU, there was unnecessary excitement about who will be the party leader. They came artificial groups. I was even grouped in a group that I don't know where that group was decided. Joe was put in another group. And then we had unnecessary remarks from other quarters. I will plead with you leaders, when you are a national leader, you go out there, weigh what you are going to say in the public. And you should respect this party. We are in this party to stay. We are in this party because this party is a national 
party. And that's why we are not subscribing to those, uh, to those regional or tribal parties. The NATCO report, you know the basis, how it came. I will urge our minority leader here to make sure that that report is implemented to the letter because most of the issues that are there were very, very beneficial to our people and to our party as ODM. Lastly, Baba, as you go to AU, we wish you all success and we pray that God gives you good health and strength as you go around campaigning for that position. And I know very well that if you get that position, that position will be very beneficial for our party and for our country and East Africa at large. We wish you all success and thank you very much for holding us together as we stand here today. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, now is my single uh, authority to invite, and I will request all of you to stand. We invite Babawetu, Raila Molodinga, Aja Hapa.